Hello, everybody. Happy Saturday. Yay. Um, okay. I'm sneaking on. I didn't even have a card, but I kind of came up with one just because I wanted to come on. And I don't have any clear blocks because they're all in my bins for my, what's it called? Yeah, club. Anyway, whatever. That's okay. We don't need them. We're going to make do because as you can see, hey, I don't need to have a lot of stuff to do this. Now, I apologize if you hear hooting and hollering. Hello, Paige. Um, my child is in his game room right next to me, like the where they have their like TV, whatever, and they have their Xbox. And you've got a bunch of grade seven boys online together playing some stupid game called Fortnite. There is a lot of screaming of, oh, no, and it's hilarious. Anyway, okay, this card, super cute, super simple. I'm going to do the stamping part first. You ready? Okay, so what I'm going to do is I've got a little bit of, do, 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 do. Hi, Patricia. I can see everybody coming on. A little bit of lemon lime twist. I got it on my block. Let's try not to get it on the paper. Ta-da. Good. Clean it off. Now, these ones are not getting super complicated, and you're going to see why. Okay, so now I'm going into a little bit of berry burst. I'm going to line it up so it's just beside it. You picking up what I'm putting down? Good. Finally, it's Sharon. I love it. So Sharon's like, hey, get on. Yeah, well, Jeanette, it would help if I actually gave you guys a warning. But it feels like life is not giving me warning right now, and so it's like I'm taking it as I can. And I figure, okay, you know what? People can always go back. And watch it again later. So you can't be mad at me. Well, those are kind of cute. You can actually make your own like cute little designer series paper with that. You seeing it? Yeah. Good. Okay. Focus. So I was listening to my tour that I did for you. Oh my gosh. How about you finish your sentence, Ange? Because like seriously, I can't get through a complete thought. Okay. So now I have got my little, what is it called? Flame. Yeah, that thing. Okay, and I'm using crushed curry for this. So we've got lemon lime twist, berry burst, Bermuda Bay. Anyone guess what designer series paper I'm rocking it with? Eh. Duh. Toi. Okay, so the card that I did is my sample. I stamped all of these off. Yes, yeah, Sharon, I was. I stamped all of these off before I stamped them. So it's a bit more muted. But then when I was looking at it, I'm like, I really feel like it needs to be a bit more, what's the word we're looking for? Done? Structured? More impact? Yes, impact. That's it. Hello, Teddy. Your room looks amazing. Thank you. I love it. It makes me very happy. Okay, so now I'm inking this one up in basic black. Yes, I'm a twister on my basic black. Don't get mad. Okay, so we're going to come in here. Let's get this bad boy straight. Now I'm keeping it straight based on the to you. And I'm going straight over top of what I've already done. Please work, please work, please work. And it worked. Ha ha. Sorry. Okay. Can we get rid of that? Now, I am going to close the blocks. Or the blocks. I'm going to close the ink pads. Why? Because I will stick things in the ink pads. We've seen it. I've done it. May or may not have even done it today. Okay, where are you going? Uh, where's your home? I don't know where your home is. There's your home. There's your marker. Yes, it, do you know it helps if you talk to your ink pads? Because they often answer, right? Okay, so next thing I have got is I have got some of that gorgeous Picture Perfect Designer Series paper. Look at that. I'm sorry, but I don't really need much else. So you'll see, it's kind of cute and it's super simple. Uh, we need snail. Ta-da, we got it. So all I'm going to do is I, I feel like it would be a perfect Stamparatus card. Oh, it totally would be. You know what? I am finding, okay, so I always take my first card and I kind of go rogue page. Like I'm like, ah, stamp, stamp here. And then I'm like, oh, would look way better using my Stamparatus because then it would be like beautiful and perfect and like. And so then when I make my second ones for myself or when I'm making multiples, I'm like, oh, stamp. The Stamparatus is my friend. Okay, so I am. Ta-da. Stuck that on. Leaving stamp pads open around my results on my elbows. Yes, it's like um, a form of tattooing, Patricia. Very cheap tattooing that washes off the following day. Okay, so this is getting smack dabbed onto. Do you not just think that like on a plain white card, wouldn't that be a, sorry, finish your sentence. This is getting stuck onto my basic black card front. Wow, that is not as much fun just to stay with your thought. Okay, now my second thought that I interrupted myself with was, wouldn't that be stunning just as a plain white card on its own? Doesn't even need anything. It's perfect, okay? So, stay put. Look at it. Admire it. Tell it it's lovely. Look at the stamp case. I'm simply going to die cut it. You're not going to have to watch that. You don't need to see that. Nobody needs to see that. I mean, I could, but 
The only reason I'm saying no is because I'm too, can I be honest, too lazy to get my big shot set up over there right now. Okay, I'm coming. I haven't left you. And just so you know, it won't cut unless you put two plates in it. So you can roll it through all you want with one plate, but nothing is going to happen. So now you're looking at nothing while I figure out after how many years of being a Stampin' Up! demo that I need to have two plates on the big shot to die cut something. Oh, good Lord, Angela. Okay, come here, come here. It's almost done. Can you hear it? It's cracking. Don't talk about me while I'm not there. I can't answer you or defend myself. Okay, I'm coming back. What did you say? Oh, no. Nothing. You didn't say anything. Oh, good. Well, you're all just gone. Okay. Well, she's loony. Yeah, she is. You're all good. Okay. Oh, I like it way better darker. Anyway, now that I've told you all that, did I put white paper inside? No, I did not. So black paper and I have issues in the sense that I don't love to write. I know lots of people write with white gel pens. I don't. Don't like them. I have pen issues. I like super smooth rolling perfect pens can't deal with it when they like kablob or miss spots whoa that was not pretty hang on so using a white gel pen for me as my son would say nao meaning not an option joe go clean your room nao <gasps> hmm hey joe guess what going out or using your phone anytime within next two weeks also nao okay we got that now i'm gonna keep this here all I'm going to grab for this one is I want a little bit of berry burst. Is that okay? We're just berry bursting. We're not getting complicated. We're keeping it simple. I feel like making a 3D project tomorrow. I'm going to make something 3D tomorrow. Okay. Uh, tongue sticking out, trying not to cut myself. Okay, there we go. And I also want, have you used this yet? This is that mini sequence trim we have. Super cute. Perfect kind of little decorative. It's a decorative decoration. Got it? <laughs> In case you missed what the purpose of the word decorative was. Well, that would be it. Okay. So next thing we're going to do. Now, I just did. I should probably use my fast fuse. Where's my fast fuse? Fast fuse. If I were fast fuse, where would I be? Oh, I would be touching your left hand. Okay. So now I'm going to come on here and I'm going to stick to this side and I'm going to just go in with my fast views using fast views is this live right now oh Christine it is and you are on live with me how are you okay got it you guys are so cute do you just tell each other Sharon are you the organizer you guys is Sharon our organizer for the lake Sharon can you come down here and organize me please okay so all I, I was trying to rewind it <laughs> okay wait, Christine I promise as soon as I'm done I'm gonna post it okay so you can go back and you can see it all then. Okay, so here, all I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna add these to that same part. Okay, ta-da! So just I just wanted a little bit of a little bit of shiny poking out. Okay, so we can leave that there. Stick you down. Then I'm gonna pop back in with my dimensionals. This is not a complicated card, guys. So if you were looking for something to make you go like holy bejeez tonight, this ain't it. You can just go holy bejeez at the fact that Angela is following through on complete thoughts right now <laughs> okay and all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stick that sweet little sentiment with our bright stamping on there see ta-da done not a hard card it's Sharon and Jeanette oh yes and see but sometimes Christine we even get Phyllis on here and then it's like a whole on full-on lake party okay where is the other sample I did so you're gonna get to choose right now I already know which one is my vote so super simple, super cute, right? But check this out. I guess I need that DSP. Oh my gosh, you have, are you kidding me, Paige Holt? You do not have this DSP? What is wrong with you, girl? The backside is even better. So there is the faded, right? So I stamped these ones off. The only thing I used different here, I used uh, Peekaboo Peach on this one. I didn't use my Bermuda Bay. And then this one, I stamped them all full strength. Which one do you like? Do, 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 do. I know it takes a second for you to see what I just said. So I'm giving y'all time to tell me because I want to know which one you like best. I, I definitely prefer this. I like the kind of bolder, um, what's it called? Left? Yeah, I'm with you, Dot. Totally. I'm with the bright here. Does anyone like this one better? Hmm. You like the darker one too. Good. Glad we're all on the same page. Hmm. Great minds think alike, right, ladies? Okay, so we need something because I, I don't know. We just do. You love the dark. 
here we go. Let's see. Now, have you, you like the right one, Jamie. Oh my God, I love you, Jamie. But you know why? It's just because you're such a soft, sweet, gentle person. That's it. You just like that more soft, sweet look like you. Okay. Not to say nobody else is soft and sweet. Jamie is just particularly sweet. Okay, so we have got, what have we got? Oh, you guys, look. Look at these pages. Like, how do you not love this? So this stamp set, if you don't know, is like, I don't know. My, well, it is my favorite. Next month, my class kit to go is all based on this stamp set. And it kind of makes me giddy. I've actually already designed my cards. But now that I want you to look, now that you've seen my card. Okay. So look, there it is right there. Simple card, just using the designer series paper again. Now, the one thing I do have to tell you is we all got super excited when we saw... I'm squishy and sweet. Well, oh, I'm squishy. I don't know what's sweet. Okay, so the Picture Perfect paper ribbon, it's not available. There was some huge strike that went on in China. Or not a strike. It was like an audit on factories and whatever. That always makes you nervous. Anyway, uh, it was not ever released. So we cannot get this Picture Perfect ribbon. Notice it had a star. I really wanted it. It was beautiful. But this designer series paper is absolutely to die for. So we've got the Picture Perfect Birthday, we've got the Designer Series Paper, you've got striped embossing folders. You can actually get a set of the ink spots that coordinates with the paper. So if you don't have all of those stamp pads, we've got the stamp and spots. Those are the little ones that come in the paper pumpkin kits that you see me use. Bermuda Bay, I use tonight. Berry Burst, I use tonight. Uh, Peekaboo Peach, well there it is there, but that's the stamped out version of it. And Pool Party, which is that wicked kind of blue. I know, Robin, me too, I was counting down. The birthday mini binder clips are super, super, super adorable. Actually, so super adorable that I will show you them. They're right here. Look at that. Super cute top of a treat bag. Oh, maybe that's what I'm going to go do. Maybe I'm going to go make a treat bag. Um, anyway, so you've got some wicked stuff there. So what have we got? It's got, okay, a 21. I have to think. 21. Oh, they've got the matching cardstock pack. 31, 41, 50. Oh, guys, so there is easily. Oh, hello, Carol. Carol loves it all. So. There's easily over $60 there. Now, why do you think I keep going with a $60 thing? Well, it's celebration. So if you're going to spend right now, you're going to spend $60 because you want your freebie, right? You need my energy. I have no energy. I crash and burn. I had a nap core this afternoon. I have to admit, I did fall asleep. I turned on The Bachelor, high quality television, and then I crashed. Okay, so um, well, let's, I can't give you the paper ribbon. Is there still 60 there? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 52... 53. Oh, there's not. Oh, yeah, there is because there is a stamp set. Okay. Let's say if you spend $60 on this stuff today, like on anything off this page, including your stamp set, I will include a free package of the Picture Perfect Party. Say that 10 times fast. Picture Perfect Party Designer Series Paper. Picture Perfect Party Designer Series Paper. I thought, okay, hang on. The embroidery hoops. I can't see the comment. It's stuck in my screen. It's weird. Anyway, okay, so. If you spend $60 on products from this page, you're going to get the Picture Perfect Party. So don't include that in your order because you're already going to get it from me. You don't have to worry about that. Anyway, that one is on till tomorrow night at 6. Mwah, 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 mwah. Take care, everybody. Have an awesome night, and I'll see you tomorrow.